Hi everyone, in today's app video, I'm gonna cover an app called Coinbase. And if you've never heard of Coinbase before, it's an app for trading cryptocurrency. So Bitcoin and other altcoins like Bitcoin can be bought and sold and transferred and converted using Coinbase. Now, I've had the app since 2017, but I wanted to make a video to kind of show you a complete walkthrough of the app, how to buy and how to sell cryptocurrency. This is not a financial advice video, it's just a tech video showing you how to use this app. And if you click the link in the description or the first comment below, it is my referral link for this app. It's available for iOS and Android. And let me briefly show you how to set this up. Once you go through the setup process, make sure you give this app as much information as possible because it's almost like a bank app, right? It needs a lot of security functions for it to work correctly and to be secure. And it's a pretty straightforward setup process. Once you're done, make sure you add a payment because you do have to link this to a bank here in order to bring in money in order to buy cryptocurrency like Bitcoin. So I already went ahead and linked up a couple of my bank accounts here. Now on the bottom, take a look. I'm on the homepage here. So let me show you what you're looking at and then we'll go through it. On top, you have portfolio balance. They have a really nice security option that lets you actually hide that too. So I'm hiding it in this case, but you have your watch list here. It's gonna show you all the things that you're following. I'll show you how to add things to this watch list. Underneath watch list, you have the top movers, which I find really helpful. It's gonna show you typically alternative coins to Bitcoin that are moving up or down and have the biggest change in the day. There is a reward program typically for watching lessons and videos here using this app, very, very cool. And some news here that you could follow along, typically updated hourly. So that's the home page. Next to the home page, you have the portfolio page. And on the portfolio page, it's gonna show you your portfolio balance right on top. And you have a nice graph of seeing how your portfolio is doing over time. So this is one my one year chart and all time chart here when I started investing in Bitcoin back in 2017. And it's gonna show you all the different balances for whatever coin you have. So you, you can see I have a lot of coins here and a lot of them will show the balance next to them if I didn't have the privacy option set. In the middle, we'll get to that in a second, but this is how you're gonna buy and sell and convert crypto. Prices right here, prices, basically this is a chart of what everything is at right now and what's tradable, gainers and losers, you could go ahead and sort by those. So for example, if you wanted to see the price of Bitcoin, and see if it's available here on this app, you could see that. Now all altcoins are not on this app, but they do add new ones all the time. But if you go to Bitcoin, for example, you could see the chart for Bitcoin alone. You could see your Bitcoin wallet and trade from here too. And under each coin on this page, you will have a great overview of the market stat, the volume, trading activity, and news for that. Okay, so that's useful. And to add them to the homepage, to your favorite page, is that star right there. So if you turn the star on, it will show on your homepage watch list. So that's how I added those there. And you have your settings page where you have your security option and your account settings as well. Okay, let's go ahead and press the middle option because we want to look at buying and selling Bitcoin here or other alternative coins. So to buy, you just press buy right on top make sure an account is linked up and as long as it is you could go ahead and select the coin here and you could see their prices so i'll just choose this coin right here then you could type in an amount in dollars or whatever your currency that you linked up so if i wanted to buy ten dollars worth of this i could buy ten dollars and there is a minimum order it says it was a dollar 99 one dollar 99 cents it's linked my account, so make sure you link a bank account here because the money does have to come from somewhere. Preview buy, and on this page, it's gonna tell you how much the price of a whole coin is. In this case, it's closer to $2,000, but I'm just buying a fraction of a coin. $9 worth because about a dollar is gonna go to a Coinbase fee. Let me select that to show you what that means. So Coinbase has a fee disclosure that tells you it's pretty transparent, but it does charge you every time you make a transaction here. And then I could go ahead and press buy now here, okay? And just like that, I've bought that cryptocurrency. And if you follow that page, it's gonna actually let you set up a recurring buy too, which is really useful, one of the newer options that's useful here to buy maybe on a weekly basis if you wanted to do that. 
Same thing if you wanna sell, you just click the middle icon, go to sell, convert. That's when you could convert one crypto to another. So if I go to that page, I could basically click over on the left side and the right side and change Bitcoin to Ethereum, for example, or really any of the altcoins or Bitcoin to another. This is a really, really useful option for converting. So for example, here is a conversion. There is no Coinbase fee on these conversions. So if I was to exchange Bitcoin here for Ethereum, there is no fee I could convert now. And you could also send to another wallet. So if I press send or receive from another wallet, let me show you that page. You could type in an amount that you want to transfer here to another wallet, press continue. And then it lets you send it to other friends here. If if you select your connections here, or if you press not now, you could type in someone's mobile number, email, and then type in a note here and send this way too, okay? But this does require the highest level of verification on this app. So I had to give it as much information as it asked me to unlock this level. And that's really the overview of Coinbase. It's been one of the most solid apps that I've had for the last few years. And I'm gonna give this app a solid five out of five. I never had any issues with this app on my phone. I use it mostly on my iPhone here. It's been secure. I've had no issues with that. And I've been able to easily buy and sell. Now, I think the fees are a little bit steep. There are other apps that basically either have no fees for Bitcoin, but they don't give you access to these uh, alternative coins like this one does. Right now, there's 40, 50 different types of coins I could buy if I wanted to. Now, I typically don't do that. I'm not a crypto expert, and I usually just stick with the more safer ones like Bitcoin, but... It is very, very easy and fast to use this app. Thanks so much for watching. I post easy to follow app tutorials and walkthroughs on this channel every single week with well over 100 videos. And I hope to catch you next time.